key to the mausoleum, but still, have no cogs. Where did I remember seeing cogs? Was it somewhere around here? I remember. Yes, Momo. There were cogs near Momo. There were cogs on the floor and on the table. Yes, there they are. Good, they're still over there. I am sure the hotel manager won't mind me taking them. Wow. Momo carved the exact design into the table. Just wow. Okay, now to quickly head back. Now to use my cognitive skills and puts these in the right order. Okay, let me look around thoroughly for any clues or items. If that's going to work, it looks like something's missing.
just as I thought. These punch cards are for the church bells. Fascinating. I no longer need these punch cards. That should have lowered the lock at the mausoleum so that I can now use the key. it worked. I have no idea how I knew it would work. It's like, Hans told me. This is surprisingly pleasant, not spooky at all. Nobody. Han's body is not there. Mount in four kills local figure. The Vorlberg family was struck by tragedy yesterday. Rudolf Vorlberg discovered the lifeless body of his son Hans at the bottom of a precipice. Loose rocks and poor visibility occasioned by the morning mist were probably the cause of the young man's fall. This is the theory put forward by the family, as there were no witnesses. Hans had just turned 18 years of age. Eight years ago, he suffered a similar accident from which he never fully recovered the full use of his mental faculties. Maybe Hans isn't dead. Maybe this was all a ruse. But why? If Hans is still alive, where is he? Is he really in Siberia? There must be more clues with this coffin. I am sure this cylinder does something.
If so, I am not seeing it. Okay, so what now? Maybe I should check out the factory and Anna Verolberg's family home? That's going to work. It looks like something's missing. place. What's that over there? Let me have a look. It looks like a large container, probably for materials. Let me head inside the factory. Oh, the water wheel 
isn't working. That's a shame. This place feels so quiet and lonely. Hopefully, very soon, it can become lively and busy again. Let me look around. Maybe I might find someone or something to help me. So they used automatons to make automatons. I wonder, over the years, how much human staff did they actually have? This is where you operate the water wheel. Maybe I should get it going again. Doesn't look like that works. significant starting the water wheel is, but it is great to see it working. I don't need to do that again.
this is the main console that controls the machinery. Don't see how this helps my current situation? Doesn't look like that works. Doesn't look like that works. Just turning on random switches is not helping. Seems only three is working. Yes, hello? Kate, what happened to you, my poor munchkin? I've been trying to contact you for hours. I'm in Europe, Ma. Job thing. What? Europe? My God. Oh, I've got such happy memories of Europe. Some of them even involve your father, but uh, that's enough of that. Tell me, where are you? Paris? London? Venice? Valle de Laine. Yeah, <laughs> I know. It's a bit out in the boonies. What in the world are you doing out there? You know, business. I've got to see through the takeover of some old family business that's got a few debts. It's a really charming place, but there's one or two weird things going on here. I, I can't go into it now. Oh, well, that's right. Your old mother's too dumb to understand it. You really do take after your father sometimes. Mother. Kate, you'll never guess who I saw yesterday. Ma, I haven't got a lot of time, you know. Frank! Ma, please. I've got to go. Frank! Frank Malkovich, the Russian opera singer. Well, maybe you don't remember him. He was quite a star in his day. Listen, Ma, I really don't have the time. I'll call you back. He is as charming as he always was. We spent the... Mom, I really have to go. I'll call you back, I promise. Lots of love. Kate! Okay, it seems that this forklift is trying to deliver items from here to the factory floor, but there is nothing for it to carry.
Oh, many thanks indeed. I am most embarrassed for you to see me like this. I lack a certain completion. You see, nobody here found the time to polish off the finishing touches. Honestly, these days, we really have lost the art of good workmanship. Uh, yeah, maybe. With whom do I have the honor of speaking? Could you please state your identity, articulating clearly? My name is Kate. Kate Walker. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Model XZ2000. My common name is Oscar. I represent the technological zenith of this factory's production. I have been designed to drive a locomotive. A touch messy, but an essential task. You said you were a train engineer? What train would that be? But Kate Walker, you have not seen the magnificent train waiting at the station? And where is that train going, Mr. Oscar? The train is going far away. Very, very far away indeed. Are you taking any passengers? My duty is to drive the train. Above all, to avoid delays. An engineer prides himself on punctuality. I will agree with you though, Kate Walker, that a train without passengers is hardly a train at all. You haven't answered my question. For further details, please consult Anna Vorlberg. Has it been a long time since you last saw Anna Vorlberg? 72 hours, 32 minutes, and 20 seconds, to be precise. This regrettable absence explains the delay in my production process. Anna Vorlberg is dead, Mr. Oscar. What do you mean by the notion of death, Kate Walker? Broken. Disactivated. Worn out. Damaged. Unplugged. Oh, that really is most bothersome. I'd rather count it on finishing my production. Can I be of use to you? Why, you certainly can. I absolutely must have my feet. My hands are Model XZ-2003. My feet are Model XZ-2005 underscore B. Be careful. The Model XZ-2005 underscore A has evidenced some rather embarrassing performance failures. Like bugs? Automatons do not have bugs, Kate Walker. They simply display functional idiosyncrasies. I'm sorry, I didn't know. What do I have to do to get you a pair of feet? Use the assembly line to construct them. You will need a production punch card, on which is recorded my body design data. Here is my own punch card. Okay, I'll give it a go. Thank you, Kate Walker. You are a very strange robot. Automaton, if you please. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to offend you. Automatons have an additional soul auxiliary, you understand? Uh, I think so. Does the name Hans Vorlberg mean something to you? Of course, he created me. But I'm sorry to say that I am yet to meet my maker. Have you any idea where he might be right now? No, Kate Walker, but I am sure I would experience great metaphysical satisfaction in his presence. Do you know Momo? No, Kate Walker. As bizarre as it may seem, I have the impression you are the only person who can help me. I very much doubt it, Kate Walker. Why do you say that? What good am I without appendices, I ask you? Oscar, I am delighted to have met you. See you again soon, I hope. Yes, Kate Walker. <laughs> 